Hey, what is up? Today I'm going to show you how you can update the firmware on your Hot 42 slash Cosmox, you know, devices or products such as this one, the um, S16 Leverless, or it can be the Board 16, which is a semi mix box, hit box, uh, whatever you want to call it. So for this specific video, I'm going to be updating the Board 16. So first of all, you want to go and head over to the Hot 42 website or now known as Cosmox as well, but we're still going to go here on the Hot 42 part, press on that and then head to support. Going to support, you can scroll down and you're going to be seeing the steps right here. So you can just follow this if you like, but I'm going to demonstrate it to you and I'm going to add a little bit of a safety step. Now, um, you can directly download the firmware here, but it's not always updated. It's not really the latest version. So to find the latest version, you can head over here to the link on the description down below since they're all using gp2040-ce these are all the updated uh the latest drivers or firmware for the gp2040-ce so just scroll down all the way almost to the bottom and then find the hot 42 series i'll tell you in the comment section below if ever they changed it to cosmox but as of the moment um it's still hot 42 and just click on download Upon downloading that, you're going to be receiving the file called gp24t-ce. But the added step here is to nuke the actual, let's say, BIOS of this. So maybe your device has been used somewhere. Maybe you've experimented with it. Or you can just skip the step if you just bought your device brand new. But I'll nuke mine. So basically, what this does is it erases everything. So you can head over to this link on the description down below. Uh, flash dash nuke process and uh, you can read more about it if you want to but i'm just going to go ahead and download the file here flash nuke process click on that and then from there you can go ahead and click on download the flash nuke that you have to file so just download that and you are good to go now you can follow the steps again if you just want to nuke it but i'm going to go ahead and actually demonstrate it to you so the first thing that you want to do is to know how to access the web configurator mode so there's a shortcut to this but i'm gonna go step by step so we're gonna go with the easiest way so all you have to do here is make sure that you're holding the start button while plugging in your connector so as for me i'm just gonna go and hold start press can plug in you should have some blinking lights and um yeah you can head over to your browser once again so we just have to go to the cheap 2040 c configurator web configurator so that's 192.168.7.1 and from there as you can see i can see my version right here we're currently on 0 0.7 0 0.77 and the latest is 0.710.10 so yeah hit the reboot and click on usb boot select now after that is pressed um there's this folder that's going to pop up make sure to open it as a folder and then you're going to be seeing this so what I want you to do is drag the flash nook. Boom, it's going to reconnect. Um, you don't have to do anything. And the next thing that I want you to do is drag the firmware that we've downloaded, which is 0 0.7.10. So I'll just drag it in here. Make sure that you don't touch the device. Make sure you're using pretty safe USB slot, uh, ones that doesn't disconnect or whatsoever. Now, if we just go back to the web configurator here, we can unplug it now. Uh, I just unplug. Hold start and then plug the connector back in. We can restart the uh, web configurator or just refresh it. And from there, it should tell you your latest version or your current version right here. So we're now on 7.10-2 or whatsoever. And uh, yeah, that's how easy it is to basically update the firmware of your Hot 42 device slash Cosmox. I'm sorry, I'm probably going to call their company hot 42 for the longest of time because uh yeah that's that's what i've known them for this is my third hot 42 product and they're really doing pretty well i'm going to be covering uh these other two hot devices that i've got and this youtube channel i mainly play tekken so if you're interested in that then go and follow me on my other socials where i kind of post some semi-game content uh wherein i play tekken it would be very much appreciated if you can hit that like button subscribe Share this video with your friends, especially those who doesn't really know how to update their firmware and um, in their devices uh, such as this one. Again, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys next video. Have a nice day.